Oh my gosh, guys. Typing Travis back with another video. In this video, I literally just saw this WF guy enter my race and I just flicked on the record button because I knew I needed to record this. Look at him on the top row. WF TBZ is winning the race. Oh my gosh. Now, if you don't know WF, he has like the most amount of races ever. And it's double, like, the second place person's thing. Like, that car that he's using right there, uh, 500,000, half a million races to do. He's the only person with that car. For example, he's, like, number 13th on this leaderboard. If we scroll down to number season 19, he's number 6 on this leaderboard. He's pretty much been here forever. Number 2nd on the season 13 leaderboard. Number second on season 16. See, on season 20, he's number seven. If we scroll all the way down to season six, yeah, I don't think he started playing yet. But then if we go over to season nine, he's number one on the leaderboard. He's basically been here for forever, and he has the most races. He does like thousand races plus a day. If we go over to the Hall of Fame, he's the most active player. And... He's second place on most of money. Where is the most races leaderboard? Because he's double the second pl second places. Where is most races? Did they remove most races or something? Yeah, I, I think they r removed most races. Anyway, though, I got into a race with him. I raced him. I almost beat him. I was leading in the beginning. However, I got, uh, I messed up a little bit and he overcame me. But dang. I got into a race with WF. That is, like, one of the best racers, if not the best racer ever on Nitrotype. He's been on the lead top, like, 10 leaderboard forever. He's He has the most races ever. A car that, that takes half a million races that no one else is even close to, but he has. So, yeah, I got into a race with WF. That is incredible. Incredible. Dang, that's amazing. That's so cool.